Hi guys and welcome back to yet another one of my cocktail vlogs. I'm Steve the Bartender and today I'm going to show you how to make a 19th century. So the 19th century is a riff on yesterday's cocktail, the 20th century. And the 20th century was kind of a riff on a Corpse Reviver number two. So if you haven't watched the 20th century, make sure you watch it there and then watch the other one previous to that and you'll, you'll see the, uh, the differences between each cocktail and the progression that goes along. So this one here is a whiskey based cocktail and I'm just gonna get straight into it and measure out 45 mil, 1.5 ounces. So you can use whatever uh, preferred bourbon whiskey you have. And this cocktail is a, um, was first created at the Pegu Club by Brian Miller. And you've got your white creme de cacao, 22.5 uh, mil, three quarter ounce. And exactly the same measurement with the Lillet Rouge. 22.5 mil, three quarter ounce. And I know I'm gonna get some questions about the Lillet. Uh, there's three different kinds, so I'll, I'm not gonna try and explain it. I'll leave some more details, but it, it's uh, um, very subtle. It's probably more of a sweeter uh, wine-based aperitif, but it's, a, it's got quinine in it, so it's a subtle bitter note to it. And then follow that with uh, fresh lemon juice, 22.5 mil, three quarter ounce. So it should have a really nice color, this drink, um, accented with the, uh, the twist of citrus to give us some, uh, to, some vibrancy. But add ice to your glass and then give it a good shake. And now strain into your chilled stemmed cocktail glass. I'm utilizing a Nicanora. As always, you can double strain if you prefer. Completely up to you. And then garnish with a lemon twist. And they have the 19th century cocktail. Cheers. I think the, the whiskey and the, the chocolate liqueur combination works a little bit, bit better than yesterday's 20th century. Um, although the, the creme de cacao, that's, it's not as prominent, but I don't know, I think this has got more balance, this drink. I think it's more vibrant. It, it works better, more cohesion. But um, yeah, less, less chocolate notes, which is, which is funny though, because there's actually more creme de cacao in this particular recipe than there was in yesterday's. So. I really like this, but I'd be interested to hear your feedback and the comparison between the two. Uh, I probably would, yesterday's recipe, I would vary just a tiny little bit. I'll, uh, I'll link to that video and I would have included those details in the description. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe and I'll see you soon for another cocktail video. Cheers.